Okanagan lake levels have slowed their relentless climb over the past few days as scorching heat melts off snowpacks weeks early. Many snow basins feeding the Okanagan have been melted dry, cutting flows of tributaries into watersheds down significantly. What this means is our rate of rise on Okanagan Lake again has uh, also reduced. And so that now we're looking at the last few days where uh, Okanagan Lake is, is, is rising uh, in terms of millimeters rather than centimeters. Reimer says we could see a peak in just a few days if we avoid rain, but all this hot weather has concerns shifting in another direction, drought. Even for areas where we have, going into the season, very high snowpack, so we, could, we can rapidly shift to um, from above normal stream flow to, to below normal. And so that uh, is, is definitely a concern that um, as we go through the snow sooner than, than normal, that that can put those pressures on. Campbell says weather will ultimately decide if the Okanagan enters drought conditions later this summer, something he can't predict this far out. For Castanet in Penticton, I'm Colin Daker. We've got date night covered. Find movie listings from around the valley under the Our Town button. Click a poster and watch a trailer. <laughs>